Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad and welcome back to Super Mario Galaxy. So, let's get started by getting our uh, 1-ups again, since I keep having to do that. At least I'd like to have them now, since you seem to give me them every single time. But now, let's head back up to the garden, because we still have stuff to do there. It's nice having that shortcut right there to skip so much. Okay. Let's head up this way. This is a long walk to just get up to the levels. But I mean, it's cool that it has a, a hub world. What is happening with the buzzing? What is happening with the buzzing? I don't know, anyway. Let's go to Matter Splatter Galaxy. Watch your step. So the way that this works is that the platforms are kind of there, but not. Uh, and you can only step on them when they are visible. So we have to be a little bit careful. It's kind of an interesting concept with the way that it's it, it's there, but it's not. It's not, not physical. Well, it's... Oh my goodness. It's not there when it's not visible. Oh, get up there, get up there, get up there, get up there, get up there. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. Yeah. I was trying to go a little bit too fast, but I think I could have made it if I didn't panic at the end. That's fine. Let's go. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, Mario, go faster. Oh, please. There we go. I got up here last time, but I... Backpedal too much. Let's get in this pipe. And now for this section, which is kind of like this, the last section, but it's just. It's just gonna go. And we have Spring Mario for this. So let's grab that, and it's gonna go. Okay. Oh dear. It's kind of like the lava is rising, but also very different at the same time. Where am I going? There. Oh, please get up there. What is that sound? Is that just space? Is that what space sounds like? Oh, that's probably this thing. This little swing. Which I probably don't want to be on with Spring Mario. Oh my goodness. I'm fine. Do I have to go back across? No. I'm good. I was a little bit worried there for a second. Because if I had to go back across, then bad things were going to happen. I think I have to be in the middle here, yep. Anyway, let's grab this coin. Get some star bits. And then... Where are we going? Oh, please hurry. Please spawn in. Oh, there. Go fast. Another swinging thing up ahead, because I can hear it. Maybe? Or maybe I can't hear it. I don't know. Or maybe I can. I don't know, but we're going down this pipe now. No choice. I was probably hearing the other one from before. Okay, this is an interesting section. Because it's just gonna go forward, and we need to take the correct paths. We can still take the paths that kind of go to nowhere, but we also have to jump a lot. But we have to jump anyway over here, so... I guess it's not too bad. I could leave the star bits there so I can actually see where I'm going. But I need I wanna just grab star bits because it's it's satisfying to grab star bits from miles away. And have them fly right into me. Take this. Oh, that's bad. 
As long as I don't die, I'm fine. Okay. Getting close to the star now. Which way? Coin? Oh, coin, you betray me. Nope. I don't know what that sound is. With the buzzing. I think it's happening when I move. Oh, is it thinking I'm trying to move the camera? I think it's thinking that I'm trying to move the camera, but I'm not. It's probably Joy-Con Drift thinking I want to move the camera. Okay. This section's fairly simple. As long as you don't mess it up. But, you know, I'd, I'd never... I'd never do that. Take you out. That was a lot better than last time. I was hoping to get them both with the spin last time, but that didn't did that just didn't work for some reason. Okay, not the coin, because that's the trap. Kind of. You can still make the jump across to there, but I just didn't do a good job of it. Oh, speaking of not doing a good job of making that jump. Oh, that's not good. Oh, it's fine. Okay. I missed at the star. We could jump to the star, but I'm just going to wait so I don't mess it up. Oh, go. Go. Oh, I have to jump to the star now. There we go. So that was Matasplatter Galaxy, and now we have a new galaxy, but also I saw a comet in this this observatory. Oh, Daredevil Comet. We haven't seen one of those yet. Okay, well, I guess we'll find out what that's like now. It's going to be a fun time. Fun. Daredevil Comet in orbit. Ghost Ship Daredevil Run! So the way that this works is... Usually we have to fight a boss... With one health! We cannot get any more health than this. No life up shrooms. No coins, just this is how much health we have. We cannot get hit once. So we have to fight Camilla on this tiny ship. Like, even the upstairs bit is... Well, the upstairs bit is the really tough part because of how small it is and the enemies that it spawns. Like, even the shell, even though that's our, our own attack, it could still kill us. Oh, get away. I want to make sure I don't miss my shot. So I'm going to wait for him to move. Or her to move, I don't know. Okay, this is good, this is fine. Oh, don't walk into the fire. Oh, stop. Please, shell, shell, shell. Shell, where are you going? Oh, fire, 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 fire. Shell, shell, no. Please, shell, come to me. I don't like you being on the ship, Camilla. You going upstairs? Good. It's not really any stairs, but still upstairs. You know what I mean. Okay, now for the tough part of this fight. Oh, don't burn me while I'm trying to get up. Oh, don't, don't, don't. Um, can I grab that? No, it's gone. Great. Oh, bad, bad, bad. Take you out, okay. Taking out the minions is the important thing. Oh, more fire. Just dodge, just dodge. Okay, green. Give me the shell. Thank you. Actually got it that time. Without it having to land on the ground first. If you can get it before it touches the ground, it's a lot easier to grab. Can I get on the side here? I should have not have done that. 
Oh, please stop going everywhere. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. I'm not sure if I was talking to the boss or myself. Let's try again. It does give you the option to leave if you just want to not do it. But I guess you have the option to just exit anyway. Let's try this again. I can do better this time. Especially if I'm up, up a little bit closer when the shell arrives because I can actually... Can actually grab it from me there a little bit faster and possibly then just throw it straight away. Like that. If I actually try to use my skill and not just leave that in you know, a drawer somewhere. No, that was terrible. Ah, uh, that's the other problem with grabbing it in midair is it just goes straight. And you can't turn in midair very well after you just grab the shell. I'm gonna wait for you to move. And then, die. Oh, really? You t did you just teleport me back? So rude. I was already I was already going up here. Go up faster, go up faster, go up faster. Go, don't hit me with the shell. I'll die. Oh, oh, oh. So many fireballs. Oh, so many fireballs. Oh my goodness, that was nearly bad. But I'm fine. If I can grab the shell. Thank you. I'm surprised that worked, but I need, now I need to hit it again. It's one of the few bosses where you have to hit it four times. I'm pretty sure it might be the only one. Because we hit it twice downstairs, but we also have to hit it again. Oh, this is a, not a good place to be. When you're right there. Oh my goodness, I bumped into an invisible wall and I nearly died. Oh my goodness. Don't kill me now. Die! Thank you. Thank you for dying. You know, like, colors and all that. Like, your shirt. Your shirt is now blue or something. I, I don't know. That's how dying works, right? So that's what a Daredevil combo is like. There's several places that we have we could do that, but we haven't unlocked it yet, so let's just be happy for now that we don't have to do that. And I guess we have two other planets or galaxies still to go to. Oh my goodness. Let's go to the Dreadnought Galaxy. Infiltrating the Dreadnought. So this is kind of a, uh, a stealth mission starting off, so we can't go into the lights. I don't know what happens if you go into the lights, but I just know t that touching the light is bad, so... Let's just avoid that if we can. I mean, it might hurt you or it might, I don't know, try to hurt you. It might just alert something to try and hurt you, but I don't actually know. I'm guessing that it just tries to kill you. Like it, like the, like it kind of, I don't know. I don't know. Like it, yeah. I'm guessing if you touch it, it's bad. Because it will hurt you. Can I get you please? I could jump into one, just to see what happens. I mean, there's a lot at the very beginning to make you find out what happens if you touch it. I actually think it might pull you into it and then kill you like that. But anyway, got a 2D section here. Ow! I jumped right into that because I thought it was going to stop sooner than that, but it didn't. Okay. Get all of those. And let's go up here. We have to be careful not to get crushed in between these small bits of this area down there. But now, we can get up here. That'll be good. 
Get a life up shroom. And we can actually kind of get up there just by long jump or back back jump spinning um wall jump and spinning. But uh I think we're gonna actually have to try and get up there the regular way. So let's go over here and flip this thing, if I can, which changes the gravity between those two. So we can't really do that much with that. Um, especially over here because we actually have to wall jump and jump on these platforms to get through here without dying. Oh, get up there, Mario. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh! I didn't know you could bounce off of those. That's interesting. Well, I'm going to be a little bit more careful now. <laughs> that one's just gone. And then we flip that to go like that. Oh, and now this is the this is a tough bit here. Just getting up there. Oh, go up faster. No, don't send me down. Oh, don't, 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 don't. Get up there. Get up there, Mario. Mario, 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 please. Oh, Mario. Okay. This thing makes us spin as we fall down so we can go down slowly. Okay, back on the outside. Now that we're not dying, we have these bombs that keep that are there here, so let's go up this way. We can kill these green things. Oh, oh, the platform. Oh, the platform. I think it just goes away when I go away. Onto the next one. So let's just get up here before all that breaks. If we get a bomb up, a bomb up here, which were those things, uh, the, the bombs that were down there, uh, we could blow this up for a one-up, but we don't. We don't. That literally doesn't matter at all. So let's just go up this way. It would only matter if we were dying a lot in here, which we are currently doing all right. Oh, there's also the bomb bombs up here, which you can probably get to that one up easier. Now, let's see what happens if I die in the stealth. Stealth me. Okay, yeah, that just shocks you. Okay. So let's pull, pull star. No. Sling star away. And let's figure out what we need to do next. There's a bullet bill launcher over here. Get up and get down. Because that's going to raise the water level. Which means that's pretty cool. Now we just have to get through this section. We should be alright. Oh, that's actually, this is actually pretty cool because you actually can stand on top of these um, security things, I guess. Let's go up here. I'm going to just hold off on that quickly. Oh, this is just another way to get up. Okay. So there's probably a faster way to get around than just taking the path that's given to me. Oh, don't go down. Why did I do that? How did I do that so badly? Oh, don't zap me. <laughs> That's the other thing about falling in the water, is you get zapped by the things if you're not careful. But luckily there's also star bits over here that I can just grab. For a hundred star bits. And a one-up. Okay, let me be a little bit more careful here. I didn't know which way this thing was going to go. It was hard to tell when I was on a moving platform. Oh, please, land. Good. I'm not going to get that one up. Okay. Where am I going here? Just go, I guess. Cool. Good. I'm just going to zap myself real quick. I wanted a hot, toasty Mario. So, yeah, we've infiltrated the Dreadnought. I guess. Let me just quickly check the map, although I doubt there's anything to worry about. No, nope. cool, good. Let's keep going. Let's head back to Dreadnought Galaxy because there's still some more stars to get there. Dreadnought's Colossal Cannons.
I like how this is, the Dreadnought is kind of like a space, like, oh, I don't know, I don't even know the words. Uh, it's kind of like a, a space fortress, I guess. Also, I'm going to grab this one up here since that's, I, I noticed that was down there. And it seems very easy to just get this one up. I mean, other than just waiting around for the bob -omb to blow up. That's a very, an extremely well hidden one up because I could see it from up here. But anyway, because it was down there. But I guess uh, it's easy to overlook if you're not looking for it or just look, focusing on what you have to do next, which is stand on this thing to make it turn on a specific angle. So there we go. Now let's light up all of these flip switches while dodging these chain chomps which eventually I believe oh please Mario eventually I believe explode into star bits if you get all of the panels so the more that you have on screen the better because it means you get more star bits but anyway now let's go over this way and then figure out which way it wants to turn that way This is working, right? Oh, I'm just gonna jump and to not fall off, hopefully. Although we have these things to worry about as well. These enemies. Which I can probably just dodge, right? But if I can if I can spin them back, that'd also be good. Without dying. Oh. Actually I think I need to take them out to actually keep going. So let's take you out and then that will open up the bridge. So let's see what's over here. I'm trying to avoid that. Okay, that's just coins. That's star bits, but I'm gonna leave that bob on there because that's gonna be a problem if I stay there too long. It's probably not gonna kill me, but it's probably gonna be close enough to me that it's gonna try and knock me off the edge. And I don't want to do that at the end of a section. That's the that's the thing. But anyway, now we have this section where we need to dodge everything and keep moving and you're gonna remember this section if you play this game enough and get all the stars because this section is a thing that exists I'm just gonna leave it at that for now and then I'll explain what I mean by that later on but anyway we have to get off of that platform because it's gonna crash into that spiky thing and let's keep going please be star bits thank you And let's flip again, since that's going to crash into those. Okay. We're still good. Oh, which way? Which what way? Okay, it was going to turn up. Good. I was a little bit concerned for a moment because it was... I'm about to run into a spike thing, and it, I saw this platform up here, but I didn't know if I was supposed to jump for it. But nope, it's just fine. It just goes up. Oh, please. This is not a 2D section, it's, it's still a 3D section, so it's a little bit easier to accidentally walk forward off the edge. Okay, let's jump down here. Oh, careful, 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 careful. Oh, bad, 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 bad. Don't let the platform leave without you. Okay, I somehow didn't die. But anyway, we have this thing to worry about now. And the star's over there. Let's dodge that. And let's go. What's the new galaxy? Were there another, was there another galaxy that I didn't see? Hang on. Where? What? I'm con- I'm confused. There was definitely a new galaxy here, right? Hang on. Yeah. No, that's the engine room. Okay. 
I'm okay now. I was very concerned for a minute, but no, that's the that's the engine room. Let's see if I can jump down well enough. Good enough, cool, good, good. Let's go in the engine room and see what this new galaxy is all about. Because there's only four in the the garden, which is kind of nice. Bonefin Galaxy. King Fins, Fearsome Waters. So just quickly, this background is pretty cool. It's got little, like, ghost faces, I suppose. All coming from there and then going into the blue bit over there. This background was reused for Super Mario Galaxy 2 as well. And I like how it looks in that because you can actually see the full thing. But anyway, I'm just going to quickly go to the other side here. Grab the rest of these star bits I missed. And let's launch ourselves. And so now we have a kind of boss, I suppose. It's kind of like the eels on other planets that we've gone to. We just need to hit him with shells and keep track of our air, and we should be alright. We also need to dodge all of his stuff as well. Oh, hello. Just gonna grab the shell real quick. I think inside that chest might be a red shell, possibly. Also, I think we're going to be alright with green shells because of his... Oh, there's also a red shell here. Let me grab that for sure. So never mind. I don't know what's in that chest. It doesn't matter. <laughs> Just that one red shell. Where is it? There. Got to make everything easier. Go. I missed with a red shell somehow. Grab another shell again and find him again. It's not that hard to find him again. Since he's so big. Ow. Oh, and there's a life stream as well. But it doesn't matter how many times. It doesn't matter too much. You just need to hit him a few times. Oh, it's still going. Just kind of grab that life up shroom. I missed. And there's a lot of things trying to kill me right now. Oh, hello. That was not good. Oh, that's not good at all. I need a coin. Is there a coin around here somewhere? Uh, well, my only other option other than getting a coin would be to finish off the boss. So let me grab this red shell. And let me turn somewhat quickly. Where'd he go? I can see his trail. If I stay closer to the planet, I can go faster than him. Just a little bit. Oh, hello. Get him! Ow! Oh, oh, bad. Bad, 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 bad. Grab that one with health life up shrimp because that's also going to heal me a lot. There we go. Okay, shell. Ow! Oh, come on. Also, there's the full thing back there. Okay, got a shell. Let's hopefully get a good shot on him, except he's turning. Of course he is. Okay, get nice and close, and actually aim probably a little bit ahead of him. And then... hit him. Well, there we go. Just need to be careful not to touch any of the... fiery things. We also need to figure out where the star is. I can hear it. Somewhat. I'm probably going the complete wrong direction. It was probably leading me straight for it when it pulled me out of that cutscene. Oh, where? 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 There it is. 
Okay. So there we go. And that is it for this episode of Super Mario Galaxy. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.